We've got tips and recipes for healthy living. So for fun and inspiration, come and join us in the raw food world. Welcome everybody, this is Matt Monarch with the Raw Food World TV show. And again, we have my <laughs> lovely nieces here. Lauren, Megan. Londons, they're the London family. And what we're about to do today is share with you, I'm actually surprised I'm doing this because it's the best kept secret in the raw food world, is the best raw ice cream on the planet. The best. Yeah. They love the pop-up, pop-pop ice creams <laughs> that are kind of like icicle-ish. This is like yeah. the real stuff. Yeah. Real ice cream. ice cream that you get out of it, yeah. This is inspired by a good old dear friend of mine. His name is Enrique Candioti. He is no longer here. I altered the recipe a little bit. Um, but, uh, yeah. I already did the first half of the recipe. This is what I did. In here, I put three and a half cups of coconut water. You could use the Thai coconuts. Probably even taste better. We took, there it is. Three small handfuls of almonds. And I also put one fourth cup of coconut nectar in there. Yeah. You could add three dates if you like. I didn't do it. And you blend that two times to where it's a liquid. And then what we do, strain this mixture in a nut milk bag. I've got a cloth nut milk bag right here. Who wants to hold that while I pour? I'm telling you, with an eight-year-old and a ten-year-old, these two girls here, you can get so much... Nine, nearly nine. Nearly eleven. <laughs> nearly eleven. You could get so much done, it's crazy. Because they just want to help with everything. It's unbelievable. Okay. And all the, all the bits don't get in there. Right. So then we just have the best tasting liquid in the world. Okay. So what we did was we just strained this whole entire thing. We don't need this mixture. This is the almond pulp. You can use that for other recipes. So then, what we do is we add the rest of the ingredients. One cup of coconut meat. I think that's a cup. Uh, oh, look at that. <laughs> it is. It's just a cup. We're going to throw that in there. Whoops. And then what we're going to do, you could either add a cup of coconut butter or a cup of cashews. Okay. Look at that cup right on in there. Two teaspoons of vanilla powder. There we go. And then one more. That'll do it. Sweet! Three-fourths more cups of this stuff. So this is the coconut nectar. Who wants to try to get this all in? Me. <laughs> Woo! And then we also got to do a fourth cup also right here. I'll do that one. Okay. There's loads left. <laughs> you don't do that. <laughs> you don't do that, she says. <laughs> All right, so then we're going to take this, put it on the blender three times. I'll tell you how many times we actually do it, and we'll be right back. All right, everybody, so here we are. We blended this guy three times. All the ingredients. It took forever. It took forever. And that's why we got into the whole magic trick. So, what you do now is one of two things. You either just put it in a container in the freezer and you stir it every 30 minutes. Ooh, that smells good. You stir it every 30 minutes. You stir it every 30 minutes and then you're done when it gets hard. Or you can put it in a handy dandy ice cream machine. This is an ice cream machine by Cuisinart. You can buy it on Amazon, I'm pretty sure. And it just spins it on its own and refrigerates it at the same time until it's done. I don't know how long it takes, like 40 minutes, I think. And we're just gonna pour this right in here. And look at that, it fits perfectly practically. It's perfect. So what we're gonna do is let this go for 40 minutes and come back and have some ice cream. Yeah. See you in a bit. <laughs> and we're back with the Matt Monarch Raw Food, food Worlds. World. And this is the ice cream that we were making earlier. You normally put it in the freezer. 
closer before, but we're not going to. I'm going to hold it. Yeah? You, wanna, you don't have any closers on, right? You want to put... I'm a well. Okay. Okay, so you heard it from these ladies. This thing is pretty much done. I would normally put it in the freezer um, because once it's done, it's still, it's not 100% frozen, but it's like mixed frozen. Come on in, Ryan. Dad, I made ice cream. So what we're gonna do is take this guy out. Feel how cold that is. It's freezing. And then we can kind of like, Taste it. yeah, it's not 100% ice cream yet, but you can put it in the freezer at this point. It. You wanna touch it, right? Okay. It's really, really cold, huh? Oh, that's delicious. I like the ice bits. Yeah, that's, that's the part that's going to turn into... Okay, so what we're going to do, we'll put it in bowls. And you guys can take some. So they like it! Okay, here we go. Stick your spoon. Okay, put it in... <laughs> Get the sides because that's where like the like all of this bit, yeah. Can I try some rye? Yeah, you can try some rye. There's plenty of it guys, so I don't know if you're gonna like it, right? Okay, let's try. It's like ice cream. Yeah, it is. I like it, Dada. You like it, Ryan? Yeah. All right, everybody. Araya is wearing her Raw Food World T-shirt, TV <laughs> show T-shirt. There she is, rocking the house, Araya Berry Monarch. This is Matt Monarch, and we've got Lauren London and Megan London. And we'll see you next time. Rocking the raw ice cream here, everybody. Best recipe in the world. And we'll see you next time at the Rock with World TV show. <laughs> Thanks for joining us. We'll see you again at the Raw Food World. Okay, you guys want me to do this magic trick real quick? Okay. What we got here is a piece of toilet paper. Normally what I would do is ask someone for a hundred dollar bill, but you guys don't have a hundred dollar bill. No. Okay, so what I'm going to do is show you this magic trick, okay? I'm going to put it right in here. Make sure this, I go like this with my sleeve so you guys see that I'm not using my sleeves or anything like that. And I'm going to go like this. Put it in there. And then abracadabra alakazam. And then I pocket the hundred dollars and take off. Where is it? Where's what? It's going there. So it's gone. No. And let's finish this recipe. <laughs> They're checking my pockets. That's not the toilet. This is what I'm blowing my nose. This isn't this. Look, look, it's a different size. Look. See, I've got nothing in my pockets. This is where did the toilet go? What's that? Where did the toilet go? <laughs> where did the toilet roll go? Make it come back. You want me to make it come back? <laughs> Well, it's, it's kind of like in the outer space, sixth dimension thing. Okay, so you guys want me to try to make a comeback? Yeah. Okay, here we go. Yes. Okay, so here we go. We've got to do that thing again, where we... This is 
is like, this isn't, I mean, this isn't kid stuff anymore. This is like the real thing, everybody. Real magic. Yes. The thing is, you don't want to mess around with real magic. Because then if you start messing around with real magic, you might get upset at one of your friends and make them disappear. Just things might happen. And it could be not good for us. Yeah, but if you knew this like secret on how to do this. Everyone. I don't do it. Alright, here we go. This is how you go like this. You put it in. Abracadabra. Alakazam. You go like this. And it's gone.